pretty barren out here. Plus, it's a good time to sing, because I like to sing. I appreciate that. <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh cool. shit, it's Nori! Oh, Noriega! All right, you can't listen to this one. Oh, shit, keep it on, keep it on the road, senor! Okie dokie! So we are driving to the Ready Made Fest, FPV Fest, 2017! Fuck, I better slow down. Shit. The thing is, with this high performance vehicle, I tend to like to give it a little bit more pedal. I like to keep it floored all the time. Not really, I'm, I'm doing, it's 65 here. I, I was going a little bit slower, but now I'm, I'm okay. It's normal speed limit here. I'm used to California where it's like 99 at least, you know, minimum. But we're here, not we. Well, you're here with me right now, but not at the time. Not the time right now, I'm alone. But when I say we, we will be in the video on YouTube and you'll be able to watch it on YouTube at your own convenience. And the road's merging here. So we're gonna try to go cautious. We got a 55 speed limit here. We got a little blinky light out there. I don't know what the hell it is, but I can't stop looking at it. And we are driving. I think we're going to, uh, where's it going to? New New Haven Township, Ohio. That's where we're, we're at right now. We want to click on the clickety clack. Uh, boop. I better fucking pay attention here. So we're driving. I'm about 50 minutes away. I landed in Cleveland, Ohio. Something just shut out of my mouth. Um, landed in Cleveland, Ohio from Sacramento to Chicago. Shot town uh, Chicago hair air hair air airport had a delay because the engine needed an oil change just because so they did that that took about an hour and a half or so plus or minus I'm guessing it took a little bit longer like the flight was at 1 150 around there and then we didn't leave until 3 30 so one to two yeah a little over a little over an hour and a half so not too bad and then finally we took off it was about an hour flight the longest flight was from for, from uh sacramento to chicago that was a long flight um fortunately enough i got the last row in the back aisle seat which was good and that way if I had to take a dump or take a piss, but you know, I was good to go. I wasn't too worried, but I, I made sure I took a dump before I got into the airplane. I know it's disgusting, but just, just, I'm just, just bear with me, okay? It's better to take a dump before you get on the plane because then you're on that tin can for a long ass flight and depending on where your seat is, you could be stuck in the middle or in the window seat and you're popping off these little crack pops, <laughs> farting and stuff. And your belly's rumbling and then you gotta wake the two people up next to you or one person depending on where you're sitting and then you gotta go to the bathroom and the bathroom is super duper small so that's why i don't really you know just the seat's small so that's one of the reasons why i like to go before and um oh van life dog um and the toilet seats are nice and small so i don't really prefer to sit in the airplane and try to push one out and then when you get out of the stall everyone's like looking at you and stuff so it's a little it's a little awkward um where the hell are we nine miles nine and a half miles on this road so hopefully hopefully the video is going to come out good uh but, 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 but what else can i get what else can i tell you so i'm on the long road uh from cleveland airport to Wilt Williams, Newtown, New Township, or whatever. Um, yeah, so that's what I'm doing. Nothing too crazy, and I figured this way be a little bit better. That way, you're not looking directly at my face and how awkward it looks. I figured this here, the little shoulder cam. If you were a little dragon, if I was on a mission, if I was questing, do 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 do. If I was a, like a questing right now, if this was a role playing game, okay, where we went to the quest giver, the quest giver, giver was the airport, 
and it gave us our first mission was to get the baggage claim and then from the baggage claim there was another mission and we had to go to the uh, shuttle bus from the shuttle bus to the rental car place and then once we got the rental car place we got some experience and um, we got a new mission. So this is our new mission right now. This is a role playing game, real life role playing game. Think about it. Could be the new greatest thing to hit, to hit the fucking social media feed. It'd be better than those fidget spinners. Think about it. No oh, fuck, I need to slow down. I'm getting deep into this. Is this still 55? Yeah, I think so. Okay, we're good. I'll go a little bit. I'll go a little bit slower. Damn, there's some nice houses out here. You know what's crazy? I, I'm looking around. Oh, you can't look around. Can you look around? Ah, buh, buh, buh. There's some nice houses out here. It's pretty cool. I got my little dragon here. My little dr dungeon master. I got my pet dragon. I trained him from level one. I'm now a level 12 now. I'm not a full dragon trainer. It's a big ass Yagi antenna up there. Um. But I got my little my little dragon on my shoulder. That's you guys. You guys are along for the adventure. So we're driving along. Driving along on this lonely road. That lady is our person still fucking breaking. I would have hit that turn like a G, just like E braked it. A little drift, little Tokyo drift. And nailed it. A lot of cornfields out here. I when passing here, I noticed that there's a lot of a lot of lakes, lakes or ponds, which is cool. And the freaking houses out here are massive. They're big house. Everyone's got like an RV and stuff. It's kind of nice. Like big yards. I wish I could show you. But this guy's all right in my ass because I'm going slow. You could probably see him in the rear view mirror. I don't want to drive too fast. It's probably going to ride my ass because he's probably, it's probably just getting home from work. It looks like it's a utility van. He's got a ladder up there and probably some gnomes and shit. So he's probably wants to get home to his family. So I don't blame him. I'm going to make sure I pay attention to the road and drive the speed limit. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to drive the speed limit. going on Boop. my phone is acting up 44 minutes oh my god jesus oh hi yo damn these houses are so big what is up with that and there's so much land out here except for that house that house is small damn it here's these are what you call corn corn eating motherfuckers Woo, doggy, and the popcorn, ding. Not popcorn. Do they make popcorn out here? Or a little red and bocker. It looks like mint out there. Just roll around there, get some mint on you. Probably get some poison ivy. Oh shit, that's right. There's poison ivy out here. What's that? A blinky light? We got a signal light. Ooh, cemetery. Whoa. See the cemetery? Fucking pet cemetery. <laughs> a little spooky. Alright, we're gonna end it here. I gotta oh shit, my battery's almost dead. Alright, we're gonna come back to this in just a bit. Damn it, quick, you know. Uh, uh, the ESC has a, uh, a spark arrestor on it. Yeah, it's like, come on. I was like, is that your stuff? I was like, oh it just does that one. Yeah, beeps one beep per cell, yeah. All right, the uh, GoPro's going. We should be ready to go, man. Let me get my video going. Got my earplugs on. I pretty much need them. For that big prop. That oh big my motor. God. That's an in-runner too. Oh. What did you bring any guns to the All right, we got video. I don't think I did. <laughs> How long was the drive? Uh, eight and a half hours. Oh, that wasn't hours. too bad. Not too bad. I mean, long, but... Yeah. Did you just come by yourself? No, Mark. Oh, that's right, yeah, Mark. Mark. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, cool. Yeah, this we is... only live 40 minutes away. Oh, man. 
and you're lucky. <laughs> I'm surprised you fly into these things, man. That's gonna cost you a small fortune. No, I, I paid for most of it, and then the guys chipped in and helped me out for the um, like a portion of it, so yeah, that right. helped too. Who right, chipped? Who? Ready. What guys? Uh, there's a the group of guys that listen to me. Oh, hey, Ruben. That put that put up with me. <laughs> Are you ready? Let's go. We're ready. Okay. Oh, God. I'm gonna get that. <laughs> So this this trip they helped out a little bit, so it's good because we're gonna do on Saturday. Make sure stop by Saturday. We're gonna get the recorder again. Was it nine pounds? Here. Oh, I think it's ten. It's a pretty heavy plane. <laughs> Here, be careful with the prop though. Holy crap! This is heavy. Yeah. Try to take fly it. <laughs> So there we are. It. Dude, it, this is 10 ass. It, it's, it fits 12. Day launch by the man himself. Can we get a horizon view real quick? Watch this flame. I'm getting blasted. You're getting blasted? No, no, I'm getting uh, whited out. Whited out. I'm good, I'm good. Alright. You got like one battery cell left. One battery cell? <laughs> Ready, big boy? Ah. Let's do this! Yeah, if the runway... Keep it out of the runway, there's some guys along our, our shoulder over here. This is cruising. That's 50%, dude. Those fastest you made on the flyby. This guy should probably move down there. You guys should drive there. Alright, you ready? Good. I'm gonna get down low. Alright, let me record you from the from the back, because that's the best way to, to get you. <laughs> Alright, I got the back of your head. Alright, coming around, looping. Coming around the flight line. Incoming! God! <laughs> Jesus! You can hear it like peaks. Yeah, there's a guy, probably about ten feet out there on the on the on the deck. I don't know if you can see him. He's wearing a blue shirt. Here comes Hugo again. God! <laughs> Anybody standing in front of the ground station? Uh, negative. My video's getting crappy. Is it? Maybe it was my phone. Is it better now? Yeah, it's better now. It's my phone. Huh? Probably the Wi-Fi. Okay. Let me put it to airplane mode. <laughs> Look, I saw an airplane mode now. Sliding out onto the field. Look at right, some numbers right. here. Look There's at a, a, a Mavic. One, the last Should be out of the way. The, the runway the guys walking out. Air, runway the clear. Smallest in the air. God dang it! There's a dude walking out there mid runway. Yeah, I do. Jesus. Oh, you got a radar, radar gun too? Yep. Dude, that recruit sounds like nothing. I can't believe it. The advisor made it with the 45 exchange. Still another 24 minutes on the clock here it's for so group loud. two practice. So wing racing. After that, we go into our signal assignments. We put two assignments. You go next pass. You know how to do Damn it. That makes you dead. I'm, I'm, I'm sagging, dude. I can feel it. All right. Well, I'll, I'll do it. I'll do it. I'll do it. Let me get out there. You come left, left to right again. So, do me a favor before I do that. Take this my craft station, point the cross here a little bit that way, or maybe move it forward a little bit. 
forward? Yes, yeah, going people forward. Walk forward. All right, hang tight, hang tight. All right. Better? Yeah, a little bit. A little bit? Yeah, it's good. Ready? Here we go. All right. All right, ready? Recording. <laughs> Everyone's holding their ears. <laughs> huh? Oh, beautiful. Oh, sick. man. Oh, wow. That's a lot more than I thought it was going to do. Dang. Mr. No. Noise no. doing his thing last time around. Batteries are done. Alright, out on the grass. Perfect! I put a skin on it. It's a skin on the front. <laughs> it's like, oh shit! Ah, 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 this guy, right I got the need for speed. On 10S, too. Faster one for Mr. Noise. Oh! Jesus. Looks to be his third official lap here on the track under official timing. He works his way around that split S gate. Oh, yeah. oh batteries aren't even hot. Through the double gate is up to that. They must go through the gate. That's the nothing. Same direction That's warm. That's warm. So the prop, the prop's yeah. gone. Yeah, I got props. Okay. Dude. What the hell did I give him? <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> Guys, back on the track. Did we wake up the neighborhood? Oh my god, I got a headache now. <laughs> I watched that twice. Did you see I wore the earplugs? Just saw that smile on my face. Oh, Everyone. <laughs> Everyone was like. I took it right after you. Oh my god, that was freaking amazing. Noise with a 52 6 on that one. Holy crap. Once again. Let them pack. Really riding that wind on the turn. Go behind with Mr. Skies. Jeez. Holy mackerel. <laughs> Where's Brian? I hope he caught that. I caught it. All right, here we go. We're leaving. We're leaving Willard, Ohio, and making our way back. It's about 10 o'clock. The temperature is 61 degrees out here. It's actually really nice. Uh, got about an hour drive. I'm gonna get there early to the airport and just kind of just hang out there, make sure I check in and everything's good. I don't have to wait in no lines or nothing. And edit some, edit some audio from the FPV Raw podcast that we recorded over there and uh, edit the uh, Team Failsafe podcast that we, we, just, we just barely barely got together on Saturday so that'll be that and yeah should be good hopefully a good good safe flight if not then this will be uh, this will be for uh, your memories <laughs> just kidding just kidding it'll be a good flight anyways here's a quick look around of Ohio let me see if I can do this without everyone. I usually get weird if everyone's looking at me, so. so it's pretty cool. It's a nice area. Uh, these roads take forever. So these are like the main roads and they're like 35 miles per hour. They're like 35 miles per hour in some areas and they're really slow and they're just long. There really isn't any highways. And tons of land, tons of open houses. It's pretty cool. It's like this all throughout town. I'll get some more clips. I'm gonna shut the battery off so we don't kill it.